Hi everyone, welcome to QuickBooks 2018. My name is Cindy and I'm going to be walking through each of these videos with you as you go through and learn all about QuickBooks 2018. I want to give you a brief overview. I just want to give you a shout out as well and say welcome and tell you a little bit about what to expect as you go through each of these videos. We're going to start at the very beginning, so don't worry if you've never used QuickBooks or you have no clue what you're doing because I'm going to show you exactly what to do so you can set it up the correct way. Even if you're a little more experienced, you'll want to go through these just to see if there's something you didn't know or if there's a quicker way for you to do something. You can always learn something no matter how much you think you already know. So this is great for everyone no matter what skill level you happen to be at. We're going to actually start by talking a little bit about what's new in QuickBooks 2018 and then we'll jump right in and I'm going to have you guys creating your first company file. So let's go ahead and get started, get some pen and paper and sit back and take some notes. If you need to go back through any of these videos, feel free to do that. We're here for you. If you have questions, just let us know. We'll be more than happy to answer those for you. I'm going to go ahead and leave right now and we're going to jump right over and talk a little bit about what to expect and then we'll jump into the next section after that and talk about what's new. Before we actually dive in though, I want to talk to you briefly about the different versions of QuickBooks that are out there because you might get overwhelmed if you don't know which one works best for you. And we'll also wrap up module one here by talking about the online version of QuickBooks versus the desktop version. So you can make an informed decision when you decide which one that you prefer. By the way, as we go through here, I am going to mention some options that are a little different in the online version or maybe if it works better in desktop, we'll kind of talk about that as we go along. So why don't you go ahead and flip over to section two and let's talk about the different versions of QuickBooks. <music> 